Hi everyone, so I decided to make this video very quickly in between the project videos because I think this is something on topic uh, for today because the winter is coming here in Belgium and so I had a container of this bio epoxy that solidified. So I thought it was cured, so it was ready for the trash. As you can see the harder is still okay, but then I read this post um, that Matt shared on the Tal Composites forum talking about resins crystallizing. So this uh, might happen as well with the GC50, so the glass cast uh, 1050 that I used in the other tutorials to make the uh, tabletop covered with carbon fiber. So you can rewind till the uh, post and press pause if you, if you want to read the entire post, but you can reverse the process of the um, resin that crystallized. So at around eight degrees Celsius already, so I was quite astonished by the fact that at 8 degrees a resin can crystallize um, because mostly like in the winter I have 6 till 7 degrees in the workshop so um, the way to do it is to make some um, like have a big cup of hot water um, and then you just put the container into it and that will reverse the process so it's a bit like au bain marie like they say in French so it's like when you're making a a chocolate sauce you also do it in water so it's the same process you can get it as hot as you want uh, that's what Matt stated on the uh, talk composites uh, forum so I went for around 50 degrees Celsius and uh, after uh, it took uh, quite a while so it was after around one hour uh, that the resin was fully um, okay again so this is uh, as Matt stated it's a process that has no harm to the resin um, so now it's fully liquid again, and now I'm just going to do a test run after this, after this to see if the resin is still okay. So I do 100 grams of the uh, bio resin with 40% of uh, Harner. And as you might see in the, the next shots, after stirring everything up, the resin is still okay. And just keep in mind that this resin was from 2016, so it's already two, uh, almost two and a half years later and the resin is still okay. But I would always um, advise you to do a test run with around 100 grams in a cup, just to see if the exothermal reaction is still okay or not. So I hope this was informative in some way, and um, I hope everybody's ready for winter. So see you guys in the next video.